Light the bridge, watch it burn bright. With bourbon's flame, reclaim your might. Then walk away, no turning back. A path of strength where you'll not lack. Make sure you stay to the end for my full rhyme and verse. Welcome to the Hollywood Halls of Magic's Monologue. I'm Magic, your curator of personal growth and the sage keeper of the keys to today's tome of wisdom and knowledge. Today's video, she cheated on me and got engaged, revenge or karma. But before embarking on an expedition to knowledge and many people's bad choices, I thank you for the thumbs up you've given me, the subscribe and the smacking of the bell to be instantly notified of new videos. Let's begin the journey. My girlfriend 29 of two years claimed I, 40, was the love of her life. However, she secretly created a dating profile when I didn't commit to it to her within six months of our relationship. A year later, she gave me a deadline to commit to marriage. Slap to the back of the head. What is wrong with you? Are you that needy and desperate that you didn't end it after the first ultimatum? Dude, she was testing you. You failed. She's 29 years old and she's about to hit the wall and she knows it. 30 is coming up and she's desperate for her special day, a ring on her finger, because her hot girl summer, that lasted about 10 years, has run out. She's looking for some desperate sucker who will provide for her so she can get the kids she wants, then fornicate around on the side in the best of cases. Worst case, when she's ready, she'll kick Mr. Beta Bucks to the curb. Oh, that would have been you and take half or more of your assets. It's called being rewarded for bad behavior with cash and prizes by the state and courts. Guys, always be mindful. Women are lied to by society, especially if they are college educated, then the indoctrination is especially strong. They have been conditioned to believe if they follow a male life strategy of school, then work, their ass off, it will work out for them. This works for men because we have a completely different fertility window than they do. However, for women, it's completely the opposite. Their fertility peak is in their early 20s and it declines down to 30, 35. There is a reason why terms like baby rabies exists. She just met you and wanted a commitment after six months. How could you not see the crazy here? Guys, if you are dumb enough or desperate enough to marry a woman like this, she will bait and switch you, and you'll have a life of misery. Not to be confused with the Stephen King book. When I didn't, she flew off to Miami behind my back and had S-word fun with the guy successfully hiding it from me. Hmm, I believe they call that, well, deceitful and cheating. Three months and about 20 guys and sexual conversations on dating apps later, she found and had escort fun with another man and then got engaged. Slapped to the back of the head. How and why are you still talking to her? The only thing you're demonstrating to her is your weakness. Women don't respect weak men. She has found her clueless beta nice guy since she got him to commit fast. All this time, I was saving up to marry her 
and I had no idea she was cheating. Eventually, she visited me and confessed everything. Uh-huh, no, she didn't confess everything. We had S-word fun like we were in high school. Yes, she was engaged at this point and I knew. She eventually left, slapped to the back of the head. God, how weak are you? My brother, at this point, anything that happens to you from this point on out is on you. You knew she was engaged. You knew she was a cheater and you still smashed with her. I hope you use protection and have gotten a full STI panel. Guys, let me clue you in here. She now has no respect for him because he didn't walk away. She now knows you are weak, easily manipulated, and that is what she is doing. On top of that, she also knows her fiance is weak and clueless as well. Look how easily he committed to marrying her. Once the wedding is over, the bait and switch will happen and he can look forward to a lifetime of a cheating wife. I know I should cut her off. No, really? You think? But I truly love her. She and I still talk and she visits me because she loves me and I'm the best she's ever had and no one compares to me. It's all messing with my head, to be honest. Okay, hang on, hang on a second. <laughs> Slap to the back of the head. Slap to the back of the head. You love her? Slap to the back of the head. No, you moron. You love who you wish she is, not the person she has shown you she is. And she definitely does not love you. She visits me because she loves me. Slap to the back of the head. I'm the best she's ever had and no one compares. Slap to the back of the head. Since he can't see it, guys, can you see the pathetic amateur hour manipulations going on here by her? In the comments below, give your thoughts on his behavior give him some advice, and help straighten a brother out. As a matter of fact, check out my video, Five Female Manipulations Men Should Watch Out For. You can find it using the search box, or via the link I'll put in the description, or if you're watching this on YouTube, the link above. My question is this, should I tell her current fiance that she's cheating on him with me? Or should I just leave it to karma? There is no way in hell I'll ever take her back. Yeah, right. She'll show up at your door in thigh highs, heel, and a trench coat, and you'll roll over faster than a politician after a major donation in an election year. The evil side of me wants vengeance for what she did. Should I tell her fiance? Hmm, let me think about this. Uh, yes. Send him all the evidence, texts, chats, and even photos of her on her knees using your man bits as a stage microphone. Dude, she's about to be married and you are her affair partner. I should give you a slap to the back of the head just for that one. You have lost so much masculine self-respect, self-esteem, and honor that you've become her man whore, her weak little bitch. Time to blow up that bridge. Then douse the remains in Old Forester waterproof Kentucky bourbon and light that puppy up. Change your phone number, block her on social media, and go no contact. 
Lastly, you'll need to see a male counselor to work on your self-esteem issues. Take up boxing or a martial art and transform your mind and body. Oh, and let me put it to you this way. In shadows deep where love once lay, a heart betrayed must find its way. She knelt before you, lies on her lips, her touch a poison, her love eclipsed. You were her secret, her hidden shame, her heart's deceit, your soul to blame. Once exposed, let justice roar, send proof, let conscience soar. For in her lies, you'll find your peace, and in your strength, a sweet release. Light the bridge, watch it burn bright. With bourbon's flame, reclaim your might. Then walk away, no turning back. A path of strength where you'll not lack. Change your number, block her call. Rebuild your life, stand proud and tall. Find in the fight your soul's rebirth a man reborn of priceless worth. If you are of the 89.4% of the unsubscribed who watch my channel and found value in my channel, please show it by doing three things. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell, and share this with at least three friends who need to learn from my channel. Confession is good for the soul and this channel. Send me your personal relationship stories or questions to share. Or if you see an article online you think I should cover, send the link to stories at magicsmonologue.com. If you have a moment, stop by my YouTube community tab and vote on my surveys or subscribe to my locals, Rumble, Twitter, Getter, or Gab. Through this, you're leading by example, encouraging other men to rise higher and ensuring you live a life of passion, purpose, and prosperity. If you can't wait for my next new video, then click on one of these right now and enjoy another. Until next time.